Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel. Hopefully you all are having a great Friday night. Okay, getting it, got them paychecks, paid them bills, get that grocery shopping going on, and then the rest is however you want to see it prior to putting some savings in there, in your uh, savings account. Okay, but we're going to pick up from where we left off last night. This is the pictures that I forgot to include in my last night video. Now, you see those pictures on the wall. We had did a little... Uh, video about Simon not having anything on the walls and, and, and no black African artworks artifacts or anything of that nature so a lot of my family members had reminded me that you know he had bought one of those staged houses and if anybody don't know what a stage house is it's when you go into like a model home uh and new construction or old construction but they're trying to sell their house so all this wonderful decorative furniture uh decor they have uh you know they have it decorated so you can kind of envision what it could look like or what your home could look like in the inside if you like that type of style but you know you don't want to go in no blank canvas house where everything you see is just wood floors carpeting or uh, bare walls because you can't really see you know what i'm saying uh the colorism or the colors you can um definitely decorate your house in and get that feel of what room needs to be what way so yes um that, and then of course that is a stage scene as well and then we're seeing Portia look like she done had too much to drink and she parted too much the night before okay we don't know we're still trying to make it make sense all right and if you haven't gone over to my channel other channel yet please do so okay because you know i'm gonna keep bothering you bothering you all each and every one of you until the numbers increase okay i'm just saying y'all see that calendar that's laying on that table okay that's a stage prop as well that her and simon had put in for efficacy all right but if you sit up there and you blow the picture up a little bit you'll see there's nothing on the calendar <laughs> now everyday folks they use calendars they have a lot of shit on there appointments business appointments uh medical appointments um uh, veterinarian appointments if they have a little loved one um I just don't know what to say okay simon drinks Porsche drinks now if you had your business and you were looking for someone uh to brand your business or advertise for your business would you really pick Porsche? hell to the no 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 unless i wanted to have if my event was like parties uh get togethers you know stuff like that uh, then yeah I would give her the taste of life because she likes to eat and she likes to drink and then she likes to go get it sucked up and moved up all right that's all I'm saying sucked up and moved up and of course she's making plastic surgeons real real rich because she don't do any exercising she tries to fake the funk but she don't really do no exercising she goes to the plastic surgeon that's just my opinion that's what I'm going on okay but it seems like her baby girl PJ is doing much more for the uh, humanity and society than her own mama. And that's a shame to say. That's a shame to say that the little kids don't whip your ass with driving force motivation and giving back to the community. Okay? Baby girl is out there doing that darn thing. She ain't laying up with no man shacking up and, and, and going through her money like water running out of a faucet. No, sir. No, Lord. Work wins celebrate. It's the uh, Instagram channel or um, platform that her dad, Dennis McKinley, is hosting. All right. He's teaching his baby girl to not just 
receive but give back okay and i'm all oh, there for it i'm four flat tires down and i'll be riding on the rims trying to show my support okay but um we can see where Porsche, i mean uh, baby girl pj gets her talents when it comes to giving because the only thing Portia knows about is foolishness, fuckery, fraudulently fucked up behavior is what she gives us. Okay? And then she wants to give us face. So when she wants to come out in the public eye and for the perfect optics, she goes and get glammed up. I don't know how much cake on um, makeup she is wearing at this time, but she feels like she needed or she would just go missing or something to that effect. She has to have her makeup on deck. Because if she didn't, when she was sitting laying at that um at the table where business is supposed to be conducted, she's looking pretty rough. And but that's the way I said that, Porsche. That's who said that. And as you can see, I'll be doing a video on Father Time sometime tonight. Hopefully, it'll be put out before Saturday. So, look forward. He calls himself ex exercising out to Rocky. Now, I don't know what man goes and eat a full course meal the night before and wake up thinking he's going to be. This is your town. Dun, 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 dun. This is your town. You know, doing having a Rocky theme. Uh, playing in the background and him doing uh, some exercise training with his so-called trainer at his home. I think they just love social media. They just love putting shit out there. And it's not true tea. Okay. Anybody can have a photo op exercising. And then they can have a photo op where they're exercising every day. And we're seeing from the beginning how they look to towards the middle or where they're trying to be and towards the end, meaning they completed the task and now they just in rotation. Uh I mean they lost the weight, they feel good, they feel great, they're eating good. But what Simon and Portia Williams uh uses appetizers these are full course meals and they are saturated with a lot and i do mean a lot of sauces and butters so this little cute little scene where he's exercising that you'll see shortly not now on this video but i'll you know i'm just giving you a preview of what's coming brother out there training like he's finna run a marathon or get in the ring and wrestle or having a boxing match with one of his <laughs> ain't gonna get the fuck not out of him the fuck not out of him okay because he can't no train him teach um what's the name simon to eat right to exercise and to stop the drinking and smoking okay he has to come to the realization that one of them two of them or three of them don't go into having a healthy body but like i said fraudulent activity makes fraudulent people and as you can see poor show williams is sitting up there with her bare feet with an empty calendar to browse through because why why i'll tell you because there is nothing going on upstairs in that head or in that desk right there because like i said if you size it up you're gonna see ain't not now ain't not now i like how that sound even though it's not proper english ain't not now business meeting on there or some type of affair she needs to be going th going to and making plans for it but simon Gabbardi likes to say his boss lady his happy wife man get married put it on paper then you can claim the fame that she's your wife okay because if she had anything to do with sickness or whatever they're gonna ask for her mother <laughs> meaning next of kin they're not gonna ask for her boyfriend you see what i'm saying they're gonna ask for her mother so i hope y'all got some life insurance is going on and y'all have done a will and testament because if anything pop off simon you're gonna be broke you're going to not have a uh, portia to lean on to her uh celebrities contact list and Portia if something happened to Simon he's gonna leave you high and dry with no money to fry okay no money to put in that frying pan and keep mixing it up letting you eat the way you seemingly are trying to eat but people like me I think you're footing the bill he's footing the bill maybe some here and there okay he may not be like Nayoni and Nini's situation where he's milking it to his dry 
but signing is used to giving you used antique stuff that other people have had and worn out and he pass it down to you okay because if he was all of that he should have had you a house built from the ground up uh, and decorated and the designs to your expertise but as we can say you like used stuff he's a used man he gives you used cars that i never see you drive in never see you floss in you used to drive before you had simon now you're acting like an invalid that need to be driven everywhere really portia really portia is that what we really do thank god thank god thank you jesus somebody else is in the hands of raising baby girl pj and dennis mckinley gina and i give a little bit to your mama okay because she loves your mama too i see the sincerity in those pictures with her and your mom she really does love her granddaughter but she don't know how to get her daughter in check Woo we we must stop all the fakery fuckery foolishness and fraudulent activity over at the williams house okay starting with mama okay starting with mama her mama and her mama's mama okay because they are teaching this in this generational curse that i hope pj can definitely put in the background she can rise above all of that knowing that she don't have to use her face or body to get what she wants and desires in this life she needs to use her good health and her head where her brains are to strategize a, a plan of action where if she wants a man that's a want not a desire not a need you see what i'm saying but she can handle her own payroll get to her own money and become her own boss not like her mother portia Williams. but that's all i got for this video guys hope y'all like a little guy have more because i will be taping more on simon because he gives me so much commentary and we would touch a little here and there with portia and her antics that she's going on because i got to show y'all she's up here um advertising some sex toys i'm like girl couldn't you have been a consultant for candy burris could you not have been a consultant for candy burris or shouldn't this idea should have been uh fostered prior to candy burris or could you have made up a, a a makeup line but it just seems like you're becoming my new protege where you're going to be copycat portia because that's all portia likes to do is go around and copy other people's lives okay what do y'all think about that should we name her copycat portia williams Gabadia, as soon as she becomes Mrs. Gabadia, not in name only, but on paper where things can be presented to the masses because we know this hell and we will not give her that title until she becomes that title and that's Mrs. M-R-S, not M-I-S-S -S or M-S. Okay, but that's all the shade I can throw at Porsche at this time. All right, but I will be back with more and upcoming more videos okay for y'all to kick key on laugh and have a good old time all right i'll see y'all next video bye bye